Hey guys, so uh, today I'm gonna show you guys how to change uh, the membrane on the uh, Excalibur XLE 4040. So, um, what you want to do first is uh, remove uh, this shit here. Um, so, what you're gonna do is, well, as you can see, I have loosened it up, so you're gonna need um, a key 916 for this side, and then um, um, half an inch for the other side. So, me, yeah, I've already done it, so I'm just gonna remove that, and then after that, it's pretty much uh, undone like that. And um, make sure you don't lose those because these are stainless steel, so they can be quite expensive. And uh, after that, what you want to do is um, you see that little thing on the top? You want to remove that because uh, it gives oxygen to your uh, to uh, your membrane underneath, so uh, it it will remove the suction. And uh, don't lose that either. So I'm going to put it there. And then you're just going to try to pull that off. So I'm going to come back to you guys on, when I... Okay. So that basically looks like this. So it was medium hard to pull off so that's the membrane and then if you don't if you can't pull it off you can always uh, go underneath remove this one it's gonna remove uh, the other suction so I think I'm gonna have to do it so Maybe I can uh, just pull uh, the membrane. I'm gonna check on it. Oh, I think it's coming off. Oh, yeah. So, make, make sure you have something to pick up the water underneath. So, I'm gonna use both my hands to do this. Now, depending on how high your ceiling is, you're gonna have to loosen those bolts <laughs> and these bolts to pull that shit down to get the fucking filter out. So, I'm gonna have to do that. So, give me a sec. Now, while you do this, make sure you don't break that fucking thing like I did that goes here to measure that because <laughs> if you do that you're gonna have to repair this and it's gonna be a hassle yeah sucks anyways so i guess i could be able to pull it off now nope still not enough okay Now it's off. That's the filter. So as you see, the black rubber goes in the end. So it's the first one that goes in. So make sure you remember that. So now this goes in the garbage. And now you're ready to pull the brand new one that you just bought for a crazy amount of money and uh, do you see that it comes from the US but it has fucking Chinese letters on it wow can you believe it, it has Chinese letters 
and has Spanish letters. Yeah, it comes from fucking China. Yeah. And after that, on the fucking box, it has, it says, made in USA. But you know what they do? They fucking ship it by bulk. And then they package it in the US and they say it's made in the fucking US. Okay, so I'm just gonna unwrap it. Make sure you remove that sticker. You don't want it. So. Yeah. Just gonna press pause. I'm pretty sure it would have went a lot easier if I would have used a... Oh, Chris. A heat gun to remove the sticker, but I don't feel like it, so what else? Okay, so you put that in. It goes better if you like if you twist it while putting it down. So oh, now you're gonna have water flowing through that shit right here. Okay. So now it's right there with his little cap. Make sure you make sure you. Now I'm putting that in. Make sure it's uh, it's not fucking dirty in there. Like oh sorry, and uh, make sure you put it equally. Okay, I'm gonna go answer. Fucking northern tail. Okay. Okay. Now this should what you see that oh I got someone here. Okay, so there was someone here to buy booze. So now you're ready to put that shit back here. So the way it goes is you may have to make sure that this lip and this is all together so i'm gonna need my both hands to do that so i'm just so something like that so now as you see i put that little bolt there you have to make sure you put the washer there and after that that bolt so you're gonna have to tighten that up and put it quite tight i mean you don't want it to leak and on this side it's um what's that uh, that's 13 that's not okay so on that side it's half an inch so where the fuck did i put that uh, okay let me oh, let's here okay so you're gonna have to tighten that up and I still need my both hands. So yeah. So you're gonna feel it when it's tight enough. Uh, it, it just won't it just won't turn anymore. So and after that don't forget to put that shit on right here. So you you, you can put the um, Teflon tape here but I mean that's already full of it, so... Okay, so that should be tight enough. Now I just gotta pull that shit up again. Uh, so give me uh, five seconds. Okay, so um, now that's at the right height. I just need to go get the, that fucking thing that I broke earlier. So I'm 
just gonna go get that at the shop. So, um, so yeah, this filter, um, that's the part number right there. XLE-4040 dry. Um, I mean, usually when your reverse osmosis doesn't work anymore, it's because of the membrane. It's not those ones. They they usually are good for longer than the membrane. So yeah, I mean, I hope it helped you guys for the membrane and um, yeah, thanks.